Hey guys, Tari here and I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be <laughs> trying to attempt to crimp my hair. I've done it a few times since I've had this hair in but I wanted to show you guys how I crimp it as well as talk about this hair because y'all this is another Amazon wig. I haven't done an Amazon wig video in probably a few months or maybe like two months, two or three months. Um, so it's definitely long overdue. Um, the last wig I think was the one from Eunice that I ordered from Amazon, but this is a different company. It's just a random wig that I found. Um, so yeah, so of course I'm not going to talk too much. We're going to get into the video. Now I'm just going to show y'all like the details and stuff of the hair as well as the tools that I'm going to use first and then we'll get into the video just because the video would be majority time lapse. Um, so yeah. So the name of this hair company is Win Girl, Win Girl Hair. Um, and like I said, I got this off of um, Amazon. And it came in this cute like pink little baggie. Um, now I bought this with my own money. So this is not, they didn't send me this or anything. So I think the wig was like 130, I think if I'm not mistaken, but I will definitely leave the link to this wig in the description box. So if you guys are interested in it, interested in this hair, definitely check the description box. Um, but of course it does come with a card and they got Meg on there. You love Meg. It says 100% unprocessed human hair. Yeah, so that's that. They also sent me the good old wig cats. Those are my favorite wig caps to use. And y'all, this company finally got it right with the lashes. Like, girl, they sent some really, these lashes are actually really cute. So I can work with these. They don't, they don't look plastic. Um, so yeah, and then it came in like cute packaging. So I would definitely check them out. If you don't want to order hair, you could probably get like some lashes or some brushes from them. Um, now, as far as me styling my hair today, the tools that I'm going to be using is of course my hot comb and I just got this hot comb from Target. It's a golden hot I think. Oh no, Infinity Pro Con Air. And then I'm also gonna be using this uh, Bedhead Wave Artist Crimper. Um, I ordered this from Amazon as well. It was probably like a little under $30. Um, so yeah, I got that. Of course, I'm a, I have a, a brush, some got to be spray. Um, heat protectant spray, got some edge control because I'm going to do my edges, and the edge brush. So that's pretty much all I'm going to need. Oh yeah, and I forgot to say for this wig, it's actually, um, it's body wave. I think yeah it's body wave um, and I got it in 20 inches um so yeah and as y'all can see like it already got like some little waves in here but that's because I've been wearing it crimped already um I saw other people, so I just brushed through the hair to course get the kinks and stuff out. Now I saw other people, they was like spraying the got to be on it before they did the crimping when I was spraying it after to kind of get it set in place. So I'm gonna try it like spraying it before and see how that turns out. Um, so first of course I'm gonna spray my hair with this uh, heat protecting spray. And this is a Tresemme. If y'all watch any of my hair videos, y'all see me use this multiple times I like this it has um argan oil in it so not too much because you don't want the hair to get wet like be wet
one thing that I forgot to mention about this hair, um, for the front, like the perimeter area, I did have to pluck quite a bit just because the hairline was really, really thick and bulky. Now, the plus is this hair is pretty easy to pluck, like you don't have to do too much to get the strands out. But with that, you want to be careful um, just because you may over pluck. So I just made sure like while I was plucking, like I kept checking um, to make sure it was how I wanted it and I wasn't going overboard. So just if you do decide to get this wig and uh, you pluck the hairline, just make sure you are paying attention and taking your time and not working too fast because you'll ball the hairline real quick.
the finished product of my hair. It came out really, really good. I like this side better, but both sides are really, really cute. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was just a quick video showing you guys how I crimp my hair. Um, surprisingly, it came out really, really cute. Um, like I said, I'm not a pro at this. Like I've just been doing this for the past few weeks. Um, so yeah, it came out real cute. Let me show y'all the back. So that's what it looks like from the back and i'm sorry if y'all hear my cat in the background he don't have no home training um but yeah so this came out really really cute i'm really excited like i'm about to go to the beach so if you guys do like this video definitely give it a big thumbs up leave some comments down below and i will see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye guys